close to yeah, that. Yeah, boy, you don't see that every day. Well, good morning, Ben. Hi, How Ben. Are you this morning? Hi. Good morning, everybody. Chilly. I think the weather outside is translating to chilly weather inside <laughs> as well. Last night was so pretty. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Good yeah, day, a lot of yeah. stars outside. Mm -hmm. If you wake up and you look outside this morning, you'll see about a quarter full moon that's out there right now. And overall, we have a mostly dry and mostly pleasant forecast today. This is a live shot at the departure deck out at SeaTac. You can see it's a little slow going in the departure lane. You can always drop people off in the arrivals area. Just a heads up. 46 degrees right now at SeaTac, but we are seeing temperatures dropping into the 30s away from Puget Sound. So just keep in mind, it is going to be a rather chilly start to the day, but lots of sunshine to start things off. Uh, the sunshine is going to become more filtered as the day goes on. You can see this mass of clouds that you see out over the Pacific. These are a lot of those mid and high level clouds. These will be pushing over the state later this afternoon. I still think we're going to see the sun, but it's going to become that filtered sunshine. You'll probably still see shadows and the sun will still be out, but it'll appear to be uh, kind of that overcast sky. Uh, by the way, the Mariners are back in town. The Texas Rangers are in town. The roof is expected to be open. We'll We'll call it a mostly cloudy uh, evening. It should be a nice sunset. Temperatures by first pitch starting up about uh, 60 degrees and then falling into the low to mid 50s by the end of the game. So behind this mass of clouds that we're going to see today, I think we're going to stay dry the rest of the work week. We do have a weak weather system moving through on Friday. Couple of spotty showers late in the afternoon, but I think the majority of us are going to stay dry. As we head into Saturday, a somewhat more organized system actually subs mainly, mainly to our north. We will see a couple of scattered showers around on Saturday, but overall, Saturday does not appear that wet. By the time we roll into Sunday, that weather system is off to our east. We'll dry out, see a little bit more sunshine and a drier second half of the weekend. So here's that weekend forecast. We'll call it spotty showers on Saturday and partly sunny on Sunday. And notice temperatures will be cooling off into the 50s both days and also a lowering snow level. The snow level could drop to pass level Saturday and Sunday. Not expecting any accumulation, at least at the passes, but I wouldn't be surprised to see a couple of snowflakes, which is kind of rare for this late in April. As we head into the new work week, a few showers on Monday, but an overall dry weather pattern and seasonal temperatures into the lower to middle 60s.